Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It is episode 22. 22? 22. Okay. And we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2 The Sith Lords. And the ever increasing title. <laughs> Sorry. It just kind of kills me that they moved the colon and extended the title instead of just. Yeah, you could have just left it at Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, and it would have been fine. Everybody would have, it would have been fine. Anyway, we've been uh, making our way through Discount Terrace. I mean, uh, <laughs> the uh, Citadel Station. And just like in Knights of the Old Republic 1, this is that uh, beaker planet before they give you a lightsaber. And I, I deeply suspect we'll find most of the rest of our party here. Um, I really thought the Pergris... Paragus Mining Station would have been that, that Telus part. Or, or uh, you know what I meant. Anyway, let's talk to Janna. See what she has to offer. I knew you'd come eventually. I'm confident that we will be able to reach a working agreement satisfactory A working agreement, you say? From a certain Where point of view. Manners? On behalf of Zerka Corporation, I would like to be the first to welcome you to Telos. Alright, um... What do you have to say about the Ithorians' complaints? I can understand why you might be on their side, but believe me, you wouldn't be doing Telos any favors assisting those amateurs. Amateurs. Habat's intentions are good enough, but good intentions won't restore Telos. His expensive policy of relocating biological specimens from Onderon without any planning will doom Telos in the end. I don't think Habat even realizes that at their current pace, they will run out of funding before even half of the restoration zones mm -hmm. are running. Zerka plans to use some of the planet's own resources to help fund the restoration. These extra funds will greatly improve the project in the long run. Habat, on the other hand, can't improve see for his own selfish concerns. Okay. The planet's own We've resources. That the surface of Telos is covered with military facilities that were either destroyed or abandoned during the Sith attack. Salvaged uh -huh. materials from these sites can either be reprocessed and put back into service, or resold to help fund the project. Uh -huh. And what can I do? Zerka has been managing the restoration project without the assistance of a droid for some time now. Habat has commandeered the new droid intelligence that was to be delivered to the station. I'd like for you mm -hmm. to meet the shipment at Dock Module 126, Shuttle Bay 2, and bring the droid back here before the Athorians foul things up again. Uh... Wait, you want me to steal their droid? Or is this, uh, not stealing, just property reallocation? Requisition, if it helps. As the Republic's hmm. fund for the restoration of Telos is requisition between both parties, it really isn't stealing, as you put it. It will save the Republic no. time and money if we cut through the process of having a droid transferred Look, to Look, you're giving off a lot of dark, dark side vo quest vibes. Um, if you want. If you want me to do this, it'll cost you money. I'll have the droid here right away. I'll have to think about it. Uh, you're asking me to commit a crime. I won't do that. If you're worried about the TSF, don't be. If they poke their noses into your business, I will personally take care of it. But I wouldn't mm -hmm. worry too much. The TSF understands the importance of letting us do our work. Uh, no. I won't do your dirty work. I'm sorry to hear that. If you change your mind, I'll be here. All right. Uh, huh. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm getting a lot of dark side vibes from you, lady. Especially with with the dark side, you know, the Sith looking statues in the background there, and the uh, oh, don't worry, we'll reallocate. By the way, have I? All right, uh, it's just this room that I'm walking in that I haven't mapped out. Oh, here we go. Sorry, I'm a completionist. I should probably do that off stream. Run around filling in all the map. But you never know when you're going to be this way again. Alright, that was counterproductive. But such as it is. 
All right, let me double check my uh, Let me let me wander around here a little the war bit. Is really inflated prices here in the outer no, seriously. Medical supplies. Everybody keeps going on about prices. Yada yada yada. The prices, the prices. Alright, I need to go over to the west side real quick. Because that will open it up for quick travel. Download the area map, return to the main menu. Transit to another module, so now I can go to the east side and the west side. And I've got a nice map of the area. What do we have here anyway? So we're at the information terminal. To our south, we've got the Athorian compound. We got that place over there. We got the east side. We got the medical facility and the lab station. All right. Um, Let's start with the northern stuff first. The war is really inflated oh, prices here. Oh, seriously. In medical supplies are in short supply. All right. Speaking of medical supplies, what do we have in here? Hello, Mr. Diplomat. Hello there, and greetings from Isis and Alderon. Isis and Alderon, huh? That sounds like a legal firm. Are you a legal firm? All right. Uh. Ooh, I'm a you? diplomat from Queen Talia on Onderon. My stay was supposed to have been shorter, but the contract disputes over the restoration project have prolonged it. Mm-hmm. And why are you here? The Athorians negotiated the export of flora and fauna from Onderon, but with their disagreements with Zerka, the status of our arrangement is in the air. Okay. Well, that gives me some useful information there. Hello, funny plant. <laughs> Alright, so we got the terminal, we got, uh... I'm pretty sure that's gonna be theft and get us into trouble, so let's, uh... Oh. Maybe not? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. That, that... As much as I want the materials... I do like the backdrops, though. Nope. <laughs> oh, that's good. Okay, so we do have a lab station that we can use while we're running around this place. That is good to know. Alright. That was less than helpful. Alright. Let, let... The war has really inflated prices here in the outer rim. Come on. Medical Not one of you is a bonus quest. The war has really inflated prices here. The war has really inflated prices here. In oh the come island. on, people! Medical supplies are. In the war has really inflated prices. It's good that Zerka's arrival has created new jobs on the station. Okay. But I can't say I'm happy about all the mercenaries they've hired. The war has really inflated <sighs> prices here in the outer. Rim. Like one person Medical in the whole of you. Short supply. All right. Man. <laughs> Welcome. How may I help you? Uh, Maza sent me to speak with Chiro. How about I'd like to speak? Take me to your leader. <laughs> All right, Maza sent me to speak with Chiro. Ah, you're the Jedi. Well, uh, ex Jedi, but you know, I will open doors for you now and inform Chiro. How about of your arrival? He will be pleased to see you. Yes, but will he be better than Zerka or? I'm going to have to keep reading, aren't I? Kind of wish I'd put some coffee on. Alright. Um, what about you, good sir? Anything? These contract disputes are quite distressing. The planet will not grow strong while we bicker with Zerka. Chodo Hevet has done a wonderful job of managing the restoration project. It's unfortunate that it will take some time before we can see the fruits of our labor. Hey, we got variety in you guys. No, nope, never mind. Just when I said that. Okay. But... 
Where's the boss? Alright. There's Maza. Hello again! How may I be of service? Uh... What will you do when your project is completed? It's hard to me even think that far in the future. I believe that this will consume many of the next years of my life. It is our hope, however, that the restoration of the planet will convince the Republic Senate to allow other herds to... Uh, perhaps I would be even placed in charge of a planet of my own, but that is getting quite far ahead of myself. Alright, and what do you do here? I serve primarily as Choda's assistant. My duties became even more time-consuming after the loss of our original droid intelligence. Jeez, guys, slow down. Alright, something about the herd's representative, and... Okay. Alright, here you are, Grand Puba. What you got? Ah, it gladdens me that you came. I am Chero Habat, leader of the Thorians here. I am sorry to impose our troubles upon you, but I did not know where to turn until I sensed your arrival. Uh, sensed my arrival? Yes, I am a priest of my people, an adept of the Force. I sensed an echo within the Force upon your arrival. It is a subtle disturbance unless one is actively listening for it. I suspected you were one of the remaining Jedi and hoped that you could help us. This is why I sent Moza to seek you out. Uh, Moza said you could heal me. Yeah, well, it's either that or I'm not a Jedi, but I, I feel like I want to ask about the healing first. The echo I felt upon your arrival was not a natural thing. It spoke of great pain, not of the body, but of the spirit. It is as if you once felt the force flow through you, then it was torn away brutally and quickly. The echo comes from the hollows where it once flowed through you. Uh, perhaps, and if so, how could you help? I don't want to talk about this, and... No, let's go with, I once felt the force, and it is slowly returning. It is a most unusual wound you carry. If you would permit me to examine you, perhaps I could re help restore some of what's lost. You are bold to make promises of healing while the world under your care burns and dies. Mm. You may be able to help, but there is always a price, is there not? <laughs> Do not mistake me, it is not our desire to see any living thing suffer. But the suffering of Talos is all that consumes us. Tell me, do you know the problems of our restoration efforts face? Uh, I'd like to hear your perspective on the matter. The Talosian government summoned my herd ship to Citadel Station and asked that we help them rebuild their broken world. We progressed for a time, but then our troubles with Zerka began. The corporation has gained great influence here, and we can do little to stop them. We per oh. I fear that if Zerka continues to interfere in the restoration project, it will never be completed. Telos will remain barren and lifeless, and all our work, that of the Republic, the Telosians, and my own people will have been for nothing. Uh... Why would the Telosian government allow this to happen? What do you intend to do? Let's go with the first one. Zerka is a powerful corporation with many lobbyists in the Senate and throughout the galaxy. What do you intend to do? Our first goal is to get the restoration project moving forward again. The Republic originally provided a droid intelligence to Citadel Station that would help manage the logistics of the project. It vanished some time ago. Mm-hmm. Let me guess. It, uh, was reallocated by someone somewhere else? Alright. Uh, I don't want to go vanished how, or was it stolen, because that feels a little like leading, so let me just go with go on. At great expense, my herd has acquired a second, somewhat lesser droid intelligence to take its place. It will arrive at Citadel Station. The Talosian government has offered a small escort, but I had hoped that you might see its safe transition from the docks here. Might you aid us in this matter? Um, and what would I get out of this? Yes, I'll see it to you safely. My thanks. I will send word to my people. They will be awaiting your arrival at Bay 2 Docking Module 126. I'll return with the droid intelligence. Alright, um... Is there anything here? This computer displays wildlife statistics for the restoration project. Alright, uh, which way is out? How do I get out? 
All right. And you lot there. Anything here? Nope. Vivarium? Bachani plant? This appears to be a Bachani plant, one of the many specimens the Athlorians are monitoring for the restoration process project. Leave it alone. <laughs> that, that's how you break things. Don't go touching strange plants. Welcome to the Respiration Project Vivarium. And what do you do here? I monitor the growth of the plant specimens collected here. Each of the species found on the plant's surface are represented. It is important that we observe growth patterns in a controlled environment before the large areas are transplanted. Okay. Alright, um, I still gotta get to the part where I get my stuff back. I mean, yes, a, a, a Jedi is more than a stuff, but, uh, I'd like to get my stuff back. Forgive me, Chodo, but the human, I could feel his suffering. I did not feel it until he stood before us, but then it filled my senses. Have you ever felt such an intensity before? Only once before, the day I came to Telos and strode upon its ashen surface. It is a planet's worth of pain. I do not know how he endures. Thanks. It is because he has no choice. I feel like I'm being talked about. Perhaps in helping to heal a planet, it will help him become whole again. Okay. Thank you, expositional overhearing. Alright, where's the part where I get to the other half of the station? No, that's the medical unit. Uh... That's the vivarium. Okay, I just gotta keep heading down that hall. Alright, back over to the other side. Exchange thug, you have no business with the exchange. Get out of here. Open that door or you're dead? Nah, we're not ready to do that right now. I don't have my stuff back, so I'll be going now. Good to know that that's where that is. You got something? No, inflated prices. Oh, hush. I'm so tired of inflated prices. All right, uh, Shuttle Bay Elevator. Is that, that's where I need to go next, right? All right, there we go. And that's my next stop. Hey, more unexplored area. Lovely. What you got, TSF officer? The public ship was supposed to have arrived to take control of the situation here. I hope it's not too late. The problems are becoming too much for the TSF to handle. Uh... Okay. Sealed module door. I wonder... yeah. I'm shocked, I tell you. Shocked that the sealed module door is locked. Alright. Oh. Um... You can't walk off that ledge, can you? Okay, good. <laughs> I don't... I, I, I probably shouldn't have tried that just, you know, walking around, but okay. Alright. Hello, merchant. What you got? Greetings, my name is Dendis, and if you wish to purchase or sell goods, you have come to the right place. Avoid dealing with my brother. He is unscrupulous and deceitful. Well, okay then. I heard that, you mince. Hear what you like, ruffian. I do not care. Do you see how he is? Disgusting. Yeah, I know. This is kind of funny. Um, so what you got? I may have come into a few credits. All right, med pack parts, clothing. Ooh, dark Jedi knight robes. How do you have some... Never mind. I, I don't want to know. I do like the regenerate force points. It can be upgraded with some underlays. Uh, although my armor is better than that so I don't know Norris robe okay nice Ooh, a shield suit light bonus 
Uh, that might be worth looking into later for, uh, discount. Hey, siblings are like that. All right, I don't have anybody that has heavy armor proficiency, and that's nice, but I got as good or better. I've got as good or better. That might be worth it as soon as I find somebody that has heavy armor. And for that price, I ain't buying it until then. Uh, same for that, same for that. I got some battle armor, I got some light. Um, ooh. I need to see... I need to see if that short sword is better than what I've got. Of course, I got to get my stuff back anyway. And force pike. <laughs> yeah, that could be nice. Um, those things are nice. On the other hand, uh, I think my two swords are better for the moment. An orange crystal. Hmm. That would be nice as soon as I have the parts to make a lightsaber. Uh, disruptor pistol. No, nobody's doing rifles. Not yet, anyway. Um, a band that increases wisdom. That could be nice. Gamoran war gloves. Defense bonus three, minus two dex. Yikes. I mean, that dex penalty, though. Oof. Jowl Shea, Perception Glows, Awareness plus one, Dex plus one, Wisdom plus one. Ooh, that might be worth coming back for in a little bit. Uh, Dex, oh, Stealth plus eight and Dex plus three. Hmm. All right, Multi-Shield Generator, that gives you 50% versus Electrical, 50% versus Fire, 15 for Ion. All right. Ooh. Plus four all saves and dex plus two. Hmm. Oh, there, there's some nice gear here. Uh, this might be another one that... Ooh. A skills implant. Uh, plus two to pretty much everything. That might be one of those things that you keep handy for, uh... When you're doing crafting sessions. Yeah. Alright. Uh, some Pazak cards. I can make those. I can't make the cards. But you know what? This guy might be worth visiting in between live streams. And then uh, assessing my current gear with what he's got. Come on. Fill in the map. And there's a workbench here. Which is also good. All right, what about you, good sir? Welcome, you made the right decision coming to me instead of my brother, Dendis. He has not quite grasped the ebb and fl Nonsense, I have principles. That's what I was referring to. <laughs> All right, just let me shop. Uh, oh, okay, so he's got the hacking stuff. Uh, Jedi robe, which I don't really need. Combat suit. He's got the green crystal. Ooh, that heavy blaster might be nice. Oh, but it's not upgradable. Never mind. Um, droid oxidizer? Okay. Oh, and that is a blaster pistol. Okay, that that's one of the things I wanted to make sure was that, that it was an actual pistol. Lots of ion damage, but uh, that, that's a little too situational. Uh, rifle. The Riot Buster. Ooh, a bowcaster. <laughs> Grenades of all sorts. A targeting visor is also nice. Stealth unit. Fort reflex. Stamina bumps. Ooh, plus one con, plus one strength. That might be worth coming back for. I can technically craft them, but I'm missing the, the prereq skills to make that happen. Uh, and that is a bump to the edge on some melee weapons. Although I don't know that I want to sink that much. There's a lot of money that you could sink into crafting melee weapons. 
And honestly, I don't know that I want to sink that many resources into something I'm going to end up getting rid of once I get a saver. Please, I don't want any trouble. It was an accident, I swear. That didn't look like an that... accident to me or my associate here. It looked like you wanted to make a fool of him. No, no, that wasn't the way it was. I did not mean to disturb your drinking. Allow me to leave you and go on my way. I will trouble you no longer. Not even an apology. That won't do at all. What's going on here? Here had a few things to say about us that we didn't take to so well. We're just trying to work out our differences. Uh, easy enough. Just teach him a lesson. How do you plan on doing that? I'd like to hear his side of the story. Oh, thank you. It's very simple. I was at the bar enjoying my drink when these brutes sat here elbowed their way up to the bar, spilling my beverage all over the two of us. Then they dragged me out here. Look at these two. I know what they want. To send me home with my limbs twisted, ba body battered, and spirit broken. You must help me. This doesn't have anything to do with you, stranger. Just move right along. Have a drink in the cantina. Oh, I've been itching for a brawl. I don't have my sword back yet, but I've been itching for a brawl. Uh, that sounds like a good idea. I won't let you lay a hand on him. I think you should leave now. Let's declaratively, I won't let you lay a hand on him. Just my luck. Someone who wants to be a hero. Why don't you run along before you get hurt? I don't see the force persuade. Move along now. All right, I don't want to fight you. Can we talk about it? You asked for it. You're right. I'll be leaving now. Uh, let's try. Can we talk about this? There's nothing to talk about. Uh, I don't want to fight you. There's no harm done here. Uh, here, I'll give you credits. Just leave them alone. Hmm. All right. Let's let's try just the simple. I don't I don't want to give you credits, but I don't want to fight you. You shouldn't have gotten involved. Oh. Okay. So that's how it's going to be. Bam. Maybe not that many. And then we'll push them down again. Light side points gain. Oh, there's a few of you. Um... Yeah. Oh, seriously, that didn't knock him down? Alright, we'll stun him then. Oh, thank you. I was completely helpless. These mercenaries are too much. I wish something could be done about them. Uh, I assume there's some sort of reward for this. I just didn't want them to have all the fun. I mean, that is true, but no. Why are they allowed to do this? The TSF isn't able to do much to keep peace on the station. Zerka's hired too many mercenaries. Even Zerka can't control them. The Republic must do something about this, but it's anyone's guess as to whether or not they will. By a senator. I hear it helps. Uh, uh, you should leave in case their friends come looking for them. I assume there's some sort of reward, and they won't stop me from having my fun. Nah, eh, you should leave in case they come looking. You speak the truth. I will stay away from this cantina until things settle down. Please, accept this reward. Uh, keep your credits. Reward is not necessary. Thank you, then. It's not often one sees such goodness and such evil in such a short time. Or says such, such much. Alright. I get light side points, and... Um... Uh-oh. Seriously? I haven't even gotten my stuff back. Come on. There we go. Oh, well, hello, you evil-looking thing. Are you my new opponent or my new help? Or does it depend on how I handle things? I have felt a tumor, Lord. A disturbance in the Force. Lord. 
Well, that's not ominous at all. At first, it was such a quiet thing. I did not notice it. But now I wonder as if it has always been there. I merely could not hear it before. The sound built so slowly. Yet when you listen for it, you can make out the strains, even over the background life of the universe. Do you feel it is a... <coughs> you... You are the darkness in which all life dies, my lord. Okay. All life exists to feed your power. Yikes. And my life. My life is yours. I beg you, please. Let me die. No yes. subtitles? This disturbance echoes through the force. I can follow it to its source and bring it to you. Well, all right then. I think I see how things are about to go. I will leave it once, my lord. That's right. Home skillet over there was shooting at me. All right, before I get into the cantina, I really need to get my armor and stuff back. Uh, at least everybody. Oh, hello, officer. The CSF isn't cut out to handle all the problems on Citadel Station right now. The war has really inflated prices here. Oh, now. yada yada yada. High prices. All right, you know what? Before I go too much further, I'm gonna insert it. No, before I go too much further, I'm gonna save real quick. Save. Save frequently, save often. Okay, and then I'm going to take a quick break, and then we'll be back for more. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live... You can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up, live stream archives from some of my other stuff, and various and sundry other videos. Because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, quotes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit, especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.